Hello, my name's uh, Alexis Sargent. I'm uh, the founder of uh, Voipon Solutions, a distributor based in the UK. We're here at CBIT 2015 and I'm joined with uh, David from Grandstream, who's uh, the marketing manager. Um, how are you finding the show, David? Uh, very good so far. This is the biggest presence for Grandstream ever. We've had more people than every other year, so we're very happy. Well, that's good to hear. Um, we understand that Grandstream have some uh, new IP phones on the market. Perhaps you can talk us through them. Yes, we are replacing our small business IP phones. Uh, the new series is called the GXP1600 series. We have three new models, uh, two line for the GXP1628, two line for the GXP1620 and 1625, and one line for the GXP1610. Uh, so those are models that are going to replace the uh, GXP1100 and the GXP1160 series that your customer might know, and also the GXP1405 and 1450 series that your customer might also be aware of. Uh, so those are very simple IP phone. This is an entry-level IP phone, just one line, three-way conferencing graphic display. You have the GXP1620, which is a non-POE, the non-POE version of this phone. The GXP1625 is the POE version of this phone. Two-line, three-way conferencing, LCD backlit display. Uh, and integrated PoE again on the GXP1625. And finally, the G GXP1628, which is also a two-line LCD graphic display backlit. This one has integrated PoE. This also has dual gigabit ports, as well as uh, eight integrated BLF, which is something pretty interesting for this type of uh, device in that price range. That's cool. So we, uh, we understand the Grand Stream's been on the market for, for quite some time. There's quite a lot of competition out there. It's always been um, associated with being uh, good value for money. Um, perhaps you could um, tell us why people should buy Grand Stream products and uh, another competitor. I think what makes us unique is the innovation that we bring to the IP phone industry and to uh, the IP surveillance industry. If you look at our entry level phone, even the GXP1628, having integrated BLF and dual gigabit port is something that no other vendor actually provides. We also have our video phones, we were the first uh, big company to actually provide them based on Android, which is a unique feature, and our enterprise IP phones, besides having all the features that you would expect from these phones, we have integrated Bluetooth, which is something that you don't see a lot in those phones, USB port, uh, SD card port, as well as dual gigabit for all our enterprise phones. So really the feature and the innovation we bring to the industry is what takes, uh, makes us uh, different. Oh, that's great to hear. Um, I guess the, the last question is, uh, have you got any upcoming products we can talk about? We do, we do. We are presenting at CB the GVC3200 conferencing system, which is an Android based, based on Android 4.4 with native support for Skype, Microsoft Link, Google Hangout, and uh, SIP. Uh, this is something that we're going to talk a little bit more about and maybe do a separate video on. Uh, this is a really innovative device. I think we are the first one to bring a conferencing device based on Android, which allows you to use all the app uh, from the Google Play Store. And we also have the GAC2200 audio conferencing device, which is also based on Android, you're going to have a touch screen, which allows you to use all the application again from the Google Play Store and use again Skype link to uh, make communication through the audio conferencing device. That's great. Well, many thanks for the interview, David. It's been a pleasure. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Cheers. Thank you.